Malta Massey, bringing you the latest happenings in dancehall and reggae music. Welcome, it's Malta Massey, and here are the stories making the cut for today. Maka Diamond wants the cow foot. Spice's boyfriend upset and confronts her. Nicki Minaj and Shensia may soon share the same manager. Chuggy demands full refund and apology. Spice's lawyer responds. Stay tuned for the stories in detail. And remember to follow me on Instagram at Malta underscore Massey. Yeah. <laughs> Maka Diamond says she want to call foot massive. I want you guys to check out her latest performance. Oh, Maka face look too no massive. I need to know in the comment section below. Shensia may soon be sharing her management team with hip hop superstar Nicki Minaj. According to an exclusive from Variety magazine today, the No Frauds rapper is in negotiation with Salsco, the management company headed by Wasim Sal Salby, for representation. Sources told Variety that Minaj split from Irvin Azzoff at Full Stop Management earlier this year. So if this deal goes through massive the possibility exists where a collaboration would be in the making between Nicki minaj and shensia how do feel about that massive let me know in the comment section below who remembers the other day when spice went on wendy williams and stated that she was single spice i'm single yeah. you know what <laughs> you know what and that's best for you because you're trying to grind it out. A lot of times men don't understand. They don't. No. So I got a lot of feedback underneath that post saying, yo, she's not married, so she's single. Blah, 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 blah. It seems as though her boyfriend, J-Bud, shares the same sentiments as it relates to how I define single. And apparently, in feel some kind of way about it. Anyways, check out this clip. You felt like you had to spite me on Wendy Williams? Tell her that you single. I put my ring finger up, I'm not married. Of course, guys, I can tune in to Love and Hip Hop Atlanta to see the full video. So Massive on a feel like J Bud has a right to feel upset about Spice saying that she's single, or on a feel like say him need to put a ring on it so she won't make that mistake again. Let me know in the comment section below. The legal team of Andrew French Wright, brand owner of the Caribbean music festival chug it has issued a letter of demand to grace hamilton otherwise known as spice regarding what they deemed as a no-show at the september 5th staging of the event in miami florida according to chug it Wright is demanding a refund of all money paid to spice by september 15 2021 and a written public apology as well as the removal of her offensive and baseless instagram posts in response to the defamatory allegations. The letter of demand penned by Wright's attorney Peter Champagne stated that presented evidence proves that Spice received payment in full for performance fees and all associated expenditure regarding her contract in exchange for her advertised performance. The letter was sent to Spice as well as members of her management team and booking agency Cool International Booking Agency and details the circumstances regarding her alleged breach of contract. Contract. According to a press release from Chugit, the terms of the contractual agreement stated that balance of the performance fees were due to be paid one hour prior to the entertainer's departure from the hotel to the venue of the performance. It claims that the evidence submitted shows that as per Spice's demands, these payments were made six hours before the performance time. Despite this, the team said the entertainer still did not arrive at the venue until 9.25 p.m. Further to the accused breach of contract, Chuggit said Spice and her team took to her Instagram account with over 3.7 million followers to slander the event and proprietor with what is described as an array of false claims accusing the organizers of using a fake credit card to book flights for her team members. Noting that the entertainer further blurted that Chuggit is a scam and that the event stole her fans' money 
Chugit is labeled her statements as defamatory. They said Spice's claims also incited patrons to the event to demand a refund of their ticket costs due to her non-performance. In response to that, Spice's lawyer tells Chuggit no refund, no apology. The legal team outlined seven instances in which they say Spice's contract was breached by right, starting with the much disputed time at which the dancehall artist was scheduled to perform. The release said and I quote, she was not required to perform before 9 p.m. The contract stipulated she would perform no later than 11.30 p.m without any mention of an earlier performance time. The credit card was declined by two different airlines for three of the tickets, two for people in Jamaica and one in New York. The attorney stated that no transportation was provided for Spice on her arrival in Miami and no ground transportation nor security personnel was provided for the artist by right in Miami. The required hotel room was also not provided to Spice. Wright proceeded to defame, tarnish Spice brand and reputation on social media and this matter will be pursued through the courts. Spice, the queen of dancehall, has been performing for over 20 years both locally and overseas and has always been present and on time for her shows the release ended there last week just a dash 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 so but massive who not think of a win let me know in the comment section below drunk cross scandal mega scandal in here you know god kill me for no scandal in here after you after i'm already feeling you man nice tight tight coochie you not turn up, you just dead, sir. Ain't after you promise me one way you got to do to me. No, 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 this born me bad. Uh, no, I know something this will normally happen to me, you know, but I don't know if I chew your front tight, not more than my, my penis claustrophobic. I, I, I've got go doctor go check out here, I sit there, man. So that's it for today, massive man. No big up on a nice, clean self, enough love, enough respect. Blessings upon blessings upon blessings. Positive vibrations going out to the massive. I'm out of Massey, my gone. Mount of Massey. Mount of Massey. Bring the latest in Jamaican music and culture. Like, share, comment, and subscribe now. now.